On three, can we say, um, boyfriend, girlfriend? Hey guys, I'm the Gwen from that video, so... Okay, if you thought that was awkward to watch, I'm gonna tell you now, it was so much worse in person. Like, I work in entertainment, okay? I'm pretty good at dealing with strange people and, like, diffusing, like, strange situations. I do it all the time for my job. I was so uncomfortable that I, I skirted out of there as soon as he finished, like, taking his little picture, taking his little video. I was out of there so fast. I didn't even see him, like, fall on the ground and have his little tantrum. And honestly, thank God, because how embarrassing. How embarrassing to be a grown man throwing a tantrum in public. And I mean, if one thing is super clear from the clip, it's that he just doesn't get social cues. Or he doesn't care. I mean, for one thing, he did not ask if he could record or post anything. He came up with his camera already filming. And it wasn't just me. I mean, he included one of the vendors who was literally just trying to work their booth and other cosplayers as well. And I mean, he did this all day. Like, one thing you guys gotta know, this isn't just like some people being upset in the comment section. Like, security took what he was doing pretty seriously, actually. Because, um, I mean, he didn't stop. He was just pretty much going around harassing mostly women or like female presenting people the entire day and i mean eventually he ended up getting escorted out like kicked out of the con by a bunch of security guards and police officers too <clears throat> loser what if you've never been to a con usually there's signs all around that say cosplay does not equal consent and i think that's so important for people to remember is that just because somebody goes to a con and is cosplaying your favorite character you are not entitled to a picture with them, you don't get to touch them, and you certainly don't get to film them without asking and post it online. I mean, like, really, you just have to ask. People have different boundaries of things, but I feel like for the most part, as long as you ask permission, a lot of people don't mind taking pictures or being on film at conventions. It just gets a little touchy when you're asking strangers to, on film, tell you about deeply personal information or you're, I don't know, just like straight up harassing women. I've seen a lot of cringy pickup artists, mainly in commentary YouTube videos that I watch, uh, but I... Never in a million years thought that I would have the misfortune of being a part of one this weekend.